Hey y'all, this is my first impression of the Bath & Body Works candle, Pumpkin Cookie Dough. The scent notes on this candle read, homemade cookie dough, creamy pumpkin, cinnamon sugar with essential oils. And this is a three wick candle that I purchased from Bath & Body Works. I don't think this is a repackaged scent. I think it's new although it has some similarities to some other ones, but I love this candle. Now I say this is a first impression, although this is the fourth burn. Every burn, every time I've burned it so far, it has pulled out within an hour and it has thrown throughout my house. I have an open floor plan with um, 20 foot ceilings in part of my home, not all of it, and the whole main level of my house is pretty open with, uh, I wanna say, I think like nine foot ceilings. And I typically do not burn candles in the main part of my house because the scent gets lost. If I have multiple candles or multiple like wax warmers around, then I can smell it, but usually the scent just travels upstairs. I don't go upstairs because there's our, where my boys' rooms were, are, or they don't live there anymore. My office is up there, so sometimes I'll go up there and work on some things and smell the scent. But if I'm down, mo on the main level of my house is where I spend most of my time. So my bedroom is down here, so I typically burn the candles in my bedroom. This candle I had to take out of my bedroom because it was too strong. I mean, it was, I mean, I loved it. Let's just say, I love strong scents. I love scents that will, you know, punch me in the face. But for my bedroom, it was just a little bit too much since it's a bakery scent. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to try this out into the main part of my house. I'm going to see if I can smell it. And I could. And I can not only smell it, I could smell it in other areas too, which is very unusual. So the scent isn't like super strong, like say summer boardwalk, but it throws for me. Now, I don't really get much pumpkin in this candle, which is fine by me because I don't, I don't know. I, don't, I like pumpkin, but I like it in small doses. But what I like about this one is it has a very, it does smell like cookie dough. It has that doughy, almost kind of like yeasty, doughy kind of scent, similar to, what is that candle called? Campfire Donut? Kind of similar to that, but to me, this one is yummier, sweeter. There, there's something else that's like blended in with it it's, it's not a super spicy candle. Like it says it had cinnamon in there, I think. Did it say cinnamon? Let me look on the bottom really quick. Homemade cookie. Uh, I don't know, maybe a little bit of cinnamon, but I just get a good bakery, doughy, yummy scent. I love it. I love this candle. It could be, to me, for me, it could be burned any time of year. I usually don't like the bakery scents, the, the heavier bakery, bakery, bakery scents, I'm sorry, can't talk. I usually don't like to burn those during the summer. During the summer, I'm more of a fresh, clean, fruity, fizzy type of burner, but every once in a while, I will get in the mood for it. And I do think that this one can be burned now, like. In some parts of the country where you're starting to where it's starting to get really cool in the mornings, um, it would be a good one to you know to light up in the morning to have your cup of coffee. If it's like a kind of a dreary day and it's raining outside, it's kind of um, one of those kind of cozy scents to me. So I love this candle. I'm so glad I I'm so glad that I ordered this. I being kind of ridiculous ended up ordering this candle full price and I expedited, <laughs> expedited the shipping because I, at the time I ordered it was an online exclusive. I'm not sure about it right now, but um, it is 
it was worth it to me. I had some gift cards or else I wouldn't have done it. If I didn't have the gift cards that were burning a hole in my pocket, I would not have done that. I think I said the first time I did it. Now, when I ordered expediting shipping, it said it was supposed to be here in two days. I ordered it on a Wednesday and it said it was gonna be here on a Friday. Then I got a message saying that the UPS truck or whatever truck it was on was delayed, of course. There, were, there was some bad weather going on. There was um, a hurricane or two happening at the time. And also, shipping is just slower now because of the pandemic that we're encountering. So I don't, I don't care. I, probably got it, I still probably got it faster than I normally would, but it was worth it. I got, ended up getting it on Monday. So I ordered it on Wednesday and I got it the following Monday. I love this candle. I really do. Now, I know there are some people who say it smells a lot like um, Mary Cookie or what. I don't know. For some reason, this one doesn't smell like as buttery to me as that one does. And I'm not a big fan of like really buttery scents, I guess. And so that's fine with me. To me, mostly this kind of smells like sweet dough, sweet cookie dough, I guess. Don't... I don't smell the pumpkin. The picture on the candle is really cute with the pumpkin and the cookie dough bites. I think that's really, I mean, I think it's really cute, but you know, I think this could be an all year round candle to be honest with you. So, but so far so good. The burn's been good. The scent throw has been good. The scent appeal is good. Everything's good with this candle. So I just wanted to come on here and let you know what I think about this candle so far. Now, I know that there's a possibility as I burn it a few more times that the wicks are going to start to become puny and I'm, I may have to cotton ball it or whatever. And I'll let you know in my candle empties if that happens. But for right now, I am giving this candle a thumbs up because... I like it. <laughs> so let me know if you have been able to try pumpkin cookie dough yet. I think, like I said, I think it's been out for, I'm going to say a month, but I've just started. They recently opened up my store. My store is one of the, the um, later ones to open. And although if they don't have this, I just have started getting back into the Bath and Body Works groove of things, like where I'm like, okay, so let's see what they have. So I'm looking forward to seeing what other new scents they have come out with. I saw a couple online that looked a little bit different to me, so I may be getting those as well, but this is the one that I was most interested in smelling and it doesn't disappoint me at all. So let me know down in the comments if you've tried this and what you think about it. I'd appreciate it and thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and come back. All right, y'all. Thanks so much. Bye.